In August 2020, we bought a property that came with a cute little tiny house on it. As you can see here, it was in really, really bad shape. It smelled really bad and old. The ceiling was caving in. There was no toilet except a hole in the floor and nothing was level. So we decided to flip it and turn it into a rental house. It was Blake's first time flipping a complete house and he did such a good job. Keep watching till the end to see how everything turned out. We're up here rebuilding the roof of our 1930s house. Tearing down the roof? Yep. And then rebuild? We're tearing off the roof and then we're rebuilding. And then Jackson's up there making me nervous. All right, so we've already taken off the top part of the chimney. Now I'm going to demo the bottom part. Arr! We keep finding crazy things in the walls. We just found a whole bunch of newspapers, and now we found all these wasps. Here's this nest we found in the wall. All right, here's another one. A whole bunch of dead birds in it. This looks like a bird's nest was in here. I bet you that was pretty stinky inside the wall. Oh, look at that. That's pretty gross. It's pretty big too. The whole wall is full of bird nests. And I just pulled another bird nest out of up there. Looks like they were maybe coming in over there or something. That's super gross. You had to have been able to hear them inside the wall. Super yuck. Alright, so there's a total of 15 baby birds and one baby mouse. Pretty gross. And there's the nest. So here is the nasty. We took all the ceiling down because there are parts that were not supported and the ceiling was starting to fall down. Here's what it looked like. We can see the floor in this little section. We gotta clean all that up. Super nasty. And here's the back room. I've been tearing down this wall right here. There was a wall. And I'm making this one big room for right now so I can tear up the floor and clear all this out. So we're getting there. Coming along. Right here we had to put in some temporary walls so that we could support the ceiling up for a future beam. In our tiny house. Got this beam put up yesterday. We're going to be tearing out the floors, cleaning everything up. Someday soon. Going to fix all the ceiling and everything. Show you this back room real quick. Here's the back family room. Just gotta put some new flooring in. Get the rest of it and we're done.
This is a hole in the cast iron pipe that we found four feet down after we turned on the water for the house and decided to dig everything up and replace it with a poly blue pipe so that it would work correctly. Good morning, March 19th. I have put in the flooring just yesterday in this smaller room. You can see it's just a short room, but I put all the flooring in, except for just in this corner, I had to finish up a couple things. And today I'm gonna to be doing the flooring in here. I've got some boards just laid out, but this is it. This is where the bathroom's going to be. Toilet and sink and and the shower over there. Got the pipes up. I'm going to do a stackable washer and dryer right here. And then there will be kitchen cabinets here. And then you also have the kitchen sink right here. I've just turned around. So kitchen sink and some cabinets. A little gap so the dishwasher can fold down and some more kitchen cabinets and and then the fridge right here on the side and then the bedroom will be back here in this corner me and Ja put up this uh, beam here quite the beam so that it hold everything up getting, we're getting sheetrock in today they're just carrying it in right now into our little tiny house this is going to be an exciting day! Alright, we're in the tiny house and he hasn't textured this room on the ceiling, but he's gone through and textured all of this ceiling in here. Textured most of the walls. It's still drying, so that's why you see the darker stuff there and everything, but it's called Holy Smooth. And he's just getting everything finished. He should be done on Monday. Today's Thursday. So he said he's got to come back and sand a little bit and then and then he'll be finished and we can start painting, primer and painting. But yeah, this is this is what it's looking like. He's still got to texture these walls in here. But he's got the the ceiling there finished. He's got the ceiling in here finished. So yeah, we're getting closer. It's exciting. And yeah, the door right here, so the utility closet will be quieter. But yeah, it's starting to look like a house. All right, so the tiny house is coming along. I'm just getting the last little bit of flooring done here. I got, I don't know, maybe six rows left or so. I've been doing the flooring for the last couple days. Starting to look pretty good. Got all the vents cut out on the floor. We're getting close. I just need to glue that part down back there in the corner. That's where you access the crawl space. One last little paint job and then do the outlets and then put in the cabinets. 